All right, let's go now. All right, so I want to talk to you about the, the Morse code, the entire circuit. So this one is our microcontroller. This is the brain. This is where we're going to put all the code, both for the sender and the receiver, and that's going to compile it, and it's going to run uh, whenever we want it to run. So you can see we have the digital pins here and some analog pins here. We'll talk more about those. And then power also, both the power and the ground are here. So what we did here, we created two breadboards. You will have all these components in your hand. And in one of them, this is the sender, which is basically an LED, a light, with a resistor to protect the LED. Uh, and uh, it basically what it does, it brings the code, and then what it does, it just blinks to send the Morse code message. So this is your sender. And this is your receiver. You see here, uh, like a kind of like a zigzag pattern. This is actually a resistor, but it's a photoresistor. What it does, it senses the light. So uh, what it does here, when the LED blinks uh, in different uh, frequencies, uh, you actually receive it from this sensor here. This is, uh, we use a resistor. We'll t tell you more about that. Uh, and then, then microcontroller reads that, says that, okay, this is the message that I'm getting. And then it shows it on this screen. So we connect it here. You can see like a four connections, two for the power and two for the signal, the serial port uh, message. So just a quick uh, information about the breadboards. These are like a little tiny uh, breadboards. Uh, you can see we have more complex uh, breadboards here uh, and they give you more components. Uh, but this, is, this will do for us easily. Uh, what a breadboard is, is basically to eliminate some of these wires. So in the breadboard, you can see there's like a five holes and then there's a lot of like in, in rows. So each five holes are actually connected to each other, but from one five to other row, they are not connected. We took out the back padding for you so you can see in the back. You can see there's like a metal piece. This is that metal piece that actually connects all of them together. So basically what it does, if you put something in this hole, and this hole, it makes them connected already. So you don't have to do it by yourself. So that is what a breadboard uh, uh, is. And that's what, how we're utilizing it uh, with components here. Again, this is your sender that blinks. This is your receiver that receives that blinking, converts it into a code, and shows it on the screen.